One step forward and another back I will never try to fool ya I'm one heartbeat away from going mad Girl, when you're looking like that Closer, closer I'ma get closer to you Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. We have lots of nesting to do today and this is everything that I have now to work with. We haven't had a shower or sprinkle, whatever you want to call it, for baby boy yet. So this is a few things I have from Kyler's Old Things and a few things that we've bought recently. Um, by the way, I do plan on doing a video on what all I'm reusing for my first baby and then a separate video on everything we bought and got from our friends and family um, for this baby. So make sure you're subscribed and your bell notification is on so you don't miss out on those things or any of my upcoming videos. But anyways, back to what I'm doing, which is going through all of the clothes that need to be washed and have that going while I set everything else up. And it's so, so bittersweet for me to going through all of Kyler's old clothes. I can't believe my first baby is getting so big. Uh -huh. Tom is the biggest, is the biggest thief, and we're so excited to welcome little brother to our family and can hardly wait. Here you can see that I was super surprised to see how many copper pearl bibs that we had left over from Kyler that I saved. I forgot and didn't realize we had that many. I would planned on buying more so I'm glad I found these first which I know you can never have enough burp cloths and bibs so I'll probably end up getting more but I was so extra extra excited to find all of these. If you haven't tried the copper pearl brand then you definitely need to because they're such great quality and the best ones that I used in my opinion. washing all the different sizes that we had here together and sorting them later after they were washed because it really didn't make sense to do separate loads and we also decided to sell and donate a lot of Kyler's old clothes because there were so many onesies a lot he didn't even wear and honestly you don't need that many in my opinion because they grow so fast and don't get a chance to wear all the cute little onesies that everyone is so excited to buy when you find out you're pregnant but that was just my experience. Thinking about the way that you know me No one ever cared like you care for me You 
Such a bright star in the dark space Now we're moving the dresser over just a bit because we are going to put the bassinet up against the wall um, to the left of the dresser during the day when I don't need it um, by the bed. And the bassinet I ordered in December will hopefully be here in time before he gets here. The shipping has been pushed back at least four times. So many times, but I know it'll be worth it if I can just get it before he gets here. I also have this rolling cart that I'll put together later on. Um, to keep beside the bed at night for um, the nighttime changes and the nighttime feedings. I ended up finding a few more sleepers to be washed after we started the other clothes in the washing machine already, but luckily we had more um, to be washed, which is this boppy cover, the Mamaru cover, and the infant insert for the Mamaru. Um, we're going to wash, we were going to wash the Dockatok cover, but it was way past saving at this point. There were so many stains on it and it was just so dingy, so we ended up adding a different one to our registry. So fly, you got me like All of these organizers are from Ikea and I love that they come in three different sizes. It makes it so much easier to organize and separate all the things that we have. Um, with Kyler, we had a changing table to go in his nursery that we used in our room until he transitioned to his own bedroom. But I wanted to use a dresser this time because it just makes it easier to keep his clothes um, organized in and also, he won't have a nursery in this house. He doesn't have a bedroom. We'll be moving soon to a different state for Tyler's work, which is exciting, but also we are nervous about because all of our family's here. But anyways, I'm folding all the clothes now, and I usually dislike folding laundry, but this was exciting to me because it's the first time getting all of baby boy's clothes put away, and it makes it feel more real. For the first 
I forgot to mention too that I also wash my labor gown and robe with baby boys clothes here and I'm so excited to share those with y'all. I do plan on recording some of the labor and hopefully some of the delivery. Um, we'll see but I love watching those videos and I think it would be super special to have that to look back on. Before I'm too invested, I should probably ask you, ask you all my questions, get to know you better. everything away and separating them by sizes in the different organizers um, newborns on the left and zero to three months on the right I also separated them by short sleeves and long sleeves just to make it easier um, but that's gonna be it for today's video make sure you're subscribed to my channel and I'll see y'all soon in my next one bye guys Before I'm too invested